Hi, in this video we're going to be looking at Deepcool's XFan 5 PCI slot fan. Um, let's do the unboxing quickly. Uh, the rear cardboard slides out does. And the pack over here. They provide a screw for mounting connection cable which allows for both um, three pin connection here or via molex also please note that um, there are three wires running which allows for um, RPM counts and we, we're going to be talking about RPMs um, why it's important as well it but first let's have a look at the um, fan itself as you can see it's made of blue translucent um, plastic uh, the uh, cage over here is actually uh, metal um, and, and the grill runs all the way from bottom to the top of the um, fan here um, now air intake for air intake they have um, a lot of provision from either sides which is actually quite handy um, for air to be getting sucked in from either side and being thrown out from the back now for the dimensions lengthwise the cooler is 170 millimeters exactly and widthwise it's about 28 millimeters sideways which is um, actually quite good because um, as, as they advertise this really will fit in just um, one PCI slot and possibly in between two cards maybe even two graphics cards um, and and this can be strategically advantageous that um, hot air that is generated there is taken out right then and there before it actually um, moves around in your case and increases the uh, temperature of your overall casing um, now for the sound let's um quickly hook it up there's a port at the bottom and plugs in so now i'm going to be using a um, rpm controller here to demonstrate sound levels at various rpms okay let's power it up first low it is audible but not so much so um, most of the sound that you may be hearing is from the power supply that I'm using to power up the um, fan but there is some amount of um, actually a reasonable amount of um, airflow that we can feel over here yeah, I've got cotton thread in my hand um, and we have airflow let's see about that far away it's still blowing so as you can see um, deep cool advertises that at maximum rate um, it's able to um, take out 17.18 um, cubic feet per minute which is roughly equivalent to about 50 to 70 percent um, amount of airflow that you may expect from a um, ordinary 120 millimeter fan which is eh, it's okay I mean um, the idea over here is of strategy um, or in case if you don't have any further provision to um, install a 120 millimeter fan this is actually going to be quite handy and and you can fit it in places where it makes most sense um, now let's turn up the RPM there we go in full RPM it's actually quite audible um, but there is a very good amount of airflow as you can see I'm holding the um, let's see let's this is about one feet away roughly 
as you can see and there is good amount of airflow all the way to the back um, there we have it this was the um, deep cool x fan 5 and as I have just demonstrated it can be used with a um, RPM management device um, and most gaming builds these days they tend to have some sort of RPM management system or if you plug it directly into your motherboard you can manage the RPM via software so just before you launch a game perhaps um, you can turn up the RPM and at other times when your system is not generating so much heat you can turn down the RPM um, this is actually to your advantage or if you want to leave it just at max RPM all the time um, that is quite fine as well um, so there we have it a cool little piece of um, kit there um, deep cools X fan 5 PCI slot fan um, for more videos and reviews please check out www.salesberg.com um, thank you for watching our video bye